Hi, I'm Love from Krada, a marketplace for creatives. In this digest we will tell you about trends that have been around for a very long time, some literally for a few years, but they are still popular and new creatives are being made for them, so it's definitely worth taking a closer look and trying them out if you haven't already. We will look at these trends in fresh creatives from the 19th to the 25th of March for both platforms iOS and Android. As for the Geo, it will be worldwide, and as for the networks, they will be applied in Google Ads, Facebook, IronSource, Unity, and Wangle. Before we begin, let me explain who we are. We are Karada, a marketplace for creatives. We make awesome high-performing kits for mobile games, apps, and other products. We are here to be your breath of fresh air or just to help your team scale. Let's connect and see how we can improve the performance of your creatives. So, let's start with the drawing trend. A long time ago, there were creatives with weapons drawing, with contouring on the figure so that the line didn't cross. Then there were a lot of games with rescuing dogs, where you had to draw an obstacle between the dog and the beast. And although the above-mentioned creatives are still being made, there are more interesting ideas with drawing, so let's take a look at them. For example, you can help move a character or objects by drawing, draw various obstacles between your character and the enemy, solve various puzzles and riddles, and even draw an army for yourself. As we can see from the examples, the drawing mechanics are being adapted not only for casual and hyper-casual games, but even for core games, so be sure to take a closer look and try it out if you haven't already. What do you think is still a popular trend? It's the transformation trend. It started with simple videos where a girl is transformed and most of the time her appearance is ruined during the transformation. A lot of companies still make those videos today. But now the transformation trend has become really ugly and disgusting, it's gaining more and more popularity and has been around for quite a while. It's literally when we remove pieces of teeth, squeeze out pimples, or extract dirt from ears. Honestly, it makes me feel uncomfortable and gives me goosebumps, but it works. Even if you have a mid-core or hardcore game, try cleaning a weapon and your creative, why not? And if you have a game that appeals to a female audience and you haven't tried it yet, by all means try it. Do you like running? I certainly don't. But in mobile ads, runners are still popular. It all started with simple runners, where you had to run between two or three lanes and collect bonuses. And now creative with runners and resource collecting became popular. Initially, this was popular in farming and cooking games, but now more and more genres are trying to adapt different versions of runners to their games. So, if you haven't tried to make a creative with a runner for your game yet, you should definitely try it, even if your direct competitors haven't done it yet, especially if they haven't tried it. I think a lot of people remember the creative with pipes that were once very popular and were in almost every ad. Now this trend has come back and many are trying to adapt it to their games, making the puzzles more complicated, or even just restarting the good old pipes with dryness or character washing. Overall, why not? Sometimes restarting old mechanics of creative works well. So, even if you tried to make creative with pipes before and they didn't work, just restart them now for testing. And if they worked well, all the more reason to restart them and try new versions. What do you think is one of the most long-lived and popular trends in mobile game ads right now? Towers. Every week we see dozens and sometimes hundreds of different tower ads for different games. We already talked about towers in detail in a previous video that you can watch here, but over the last week we have seen several interesting variations in different games. With towers there is one simple tip – experiment. Think about your target audience and your game and try to adapt the tower mechanics to them. I'm glad you could join me today. I hope this digest has been useful and has motivated you to experiment with fresh concepts for your creatives. Feel free to share your thoughts and recommendations for future videos in the comment section. Click the like button if you got at least one idea after watching the digest and subscribe to our channel to stay updated. 
Best of luck with your creative work. Goodbye and see you next week.